it's me, Drew, and today I'm going to be testing out as seen on TV products. I honestly spent like $100 on all this stuff. I feel like I'm not supposed to say that because it's like off-putting in some way, but you guys don't understand. Some YouTubers spend like thousands of dollars on music videos and they like take you with them to other countries. I spend like $45 and I like take you with me to the dollar store. It's like for the video though. It's not like I'm just throwing money away, which we also do actually each year at VidCon, the top YouTubers, we get together, we gather around a trash can, we light it on fire, we throw hundreds in, we just chant content, content. It's kind of fun. Anyway, let's fucking do this. Also, I'm wearing a V-neck, so that should make you and your family very comfortable. This right here is called a stretch kin. It's just a little puppy that you like stretch across your body as you do. I don't really know what kid this is for. I guess a kid who like loves dogs, but like a regular dog just isn't cutting it for him. A kid is just like, mom, I love Spot. He's the best dog ever. Thank you so much for bringing him into my life. As you also probably know, I've always felt that his limbs were a little short. So if there's like any possible way this year for Christmas, I could get like a blue stuffed version of him that I could like attach myself to. You know how lonely I feel in my body. I just really want to press my groin against that little queen. I also feel a little uncomfortable with like how happy this girl in the box seems with her stretch kin. Like they're fucking dating. Like look in her eyes. That's the only person she cares about anymore. Like she had a boyfriend at school but she's like sorry Connor, new bae. <laughs> Let's test this shit out. I feel like I'm a little tall for this. Like this is meant for like a four foot child. And a lot of you guys don't know this but I'm actually seven feet 25 inches. This is called the quick twist. It makes your hair nice. Also, it has a little Instagram logo, like they want me to follow Con Air on Instagram. Fuck no, so I can see more pictures like this. These girls look fucking mean. They look like they would have fucked with me in sixth grade and been like, why is your hair like long? Like when boys' hairs are like short. And I would have been like, Maddie, I'm not in the mood. I'm like so excited to use this and be pretty. Like honestly, if you don't have a quick twist and use it every morning, this is mean, but like you're ugly as fuck. It says comb through clean hair so it is smooth and completely free of tangles, but honestly, Honestly, like, I don't have three days. I think I'm actually fucking doing it. Okay, now we twist. Holy shit. Oh my god, like, I think I actually did it. Like, I feel like a true beaut. Like, the greatest princess that ever lived. I'm gonna make a bigger one now. I'm trying to figure this out, and I realized that while I'm doing this, I look like I'm either, like, in the band Pierce the Veil, or, like, I'm their mom. Like, good job, boys. Keep rocking. Okay, baby. Honestly, good enough. This is called the shower wow. It makes your water colorful. Honestly, I don't really like the message that this sends to the kids out there, which is like, showers are boring and procedural. You need to liven them up. No, you fucking don't. Think of all the games you can play in the shower. Wash the hole. Tickle the nipple. Pretend Simon Cowell is in there with you. All right, go baby, go. It doesn't work. This is called the Wobble Wag Giggle. <laughs> I wonder if my neighbors can hear that because that like 100% sounds like I'm shaking a toddler until he vomits. I feel like this thing is kind of like a happiness test. Like if this noise like brings you joy and like makes you laugh, you're probably happy. If this noise like makes you annoyed and very upset about life in general, you probably have some shit to work out. Personally, it makes, I want to light it on fire. No, this sounds super weird, but it kind of sounds like if SpongeBob SquarePants was like shooting a bunch of babies out of his pussy. I feel like to get the real effect of it, I have to like become a dog and play with it. <laughs> that was super weird. I kind of became an actual dog. Like I feel like in that moment, I wanted to kill a rabbit. These are called sticking clicks. They're little lights that you can stick on anywhere you want. Honestly, I got these for one reason and one reason only. They didn't come with batteries, but like you get the point. This is the Snuggie for kids Frozen edition with this little fucking asshole once again, my least favorite movie character of all time and I've never seen the film, this fucking dick. You know why this shit was on sale, motherfucker? Because no one wants you on their body. It also says here one size fits most kids. So unless your kid is like super giant or like a tiny little guy, which reminds me when I was a kid, I always wanted like a little leprechaun. Did anyone of you guys want like a little tiny thing? You just like make it do whatever you want, which kind of feels like slavery looking back on it. And that makes me uncomfortable. Also, it's sad to like think of the kid that this wouldn't fit. He's like, mommy, it doesn't work. Tommy, <laughs> look, I told you it said most kids, all right? You're not most kids, all right, sweetheart? You know I love you, but you look like a monster truck. 
I honestly don't hate it. Like, I hate that this fucking idiot gets to be on my tits because, like, he doesn't deserve it. But otherwise, like, I feel like a good little boy. This shit is called the shake weight. All right, look at that. I feel like the joke about this in middle school was always like, hey, did you see the shake weight on TV? Kind of looks like a, you know what, kind of a stroke, a stroke of a penis, huh? Which my question was always like, whose fucking dick looks like this? Honestly, though, like, I wish. Like, imagine if these were dicks. Like, things were getting hot. You fucking unzip your pants and you take out your shake weight, baby. Hey, honey, let's see what this puppy can do for your shoulders. Also, I just remembered that last night I had a whole dream about getting in a fight with that So Raven's Raven Simone and like we were in like a whole feud but like she made some good points. Like I think she won. Anyway, that's the end of my videos. Thank you for watching my video. If you like my video, please subscribe to my videos. I like saying that because I haven't said it for a while because like people got really mad about it. They're like, Drew's different now. He's a YouTuber. He has to subscribe. I'm over it. Fuck you, man. Do it. It helps me. I don't know. I'm kidding. Not like, fuck you. Like, I like you guys. You know how I feel about you. But like, I don't know, man. You can do it. Like, I got a new scarf. Whatever. I just wanted to have some fun today because like my last video got like a little serious. Like, it kind of talked about suicide in it. So I just want to be like, hey, crew, let's play with some fucking toys and pretend it's all okay. And honestly, I think it is. So leave me a fucking comment because I am very lonely. If, just if, if I killed myself, I wouldn't have to clean this up. I'm not saying I'm going to, I'm, I'm not saying it's really going to happen, but if, just if, if,